Her mom kissed her head as she tucked her in bed, supposedly safe for the night. She hugged her stuffed bear and she hadn't a care, wasn't prepared for the fight. Then out of the dark came a host of strange sounds, toys came alive all at once. They all charged the bed, even hung over her head, and threatening sounds broke the hush. The dolls attacked from the front and the back, six princesses on the advance. Pony and Pooh turned menacing too, she felt she did not have a chance. When out of the closet Miss Kitty attacked, with Grover and Grinch by her side. She reached for the light but no lamp was in sight, the darkness remained as she cried. We'll get her, Bear said, as the others he led, against us she hasn't the hope. She's ours now, we've won! The battle is done. Somebody bring me a rope. Maybe Optimus Prime can save me in time. My brother's room is right next door. There's Woody and Buzz and soldiers inside. They'll save me and settle the score. She lunged for his door and then fell to the floor. It wouldn't unlock though she tried. It seemed all was lost, then a sound pierced the dark. It came from right there by her side. Then everything stopped as they looked at her clock. The buzzing was from her alarm. The sunrise was here and it was very clear. She would now be safe from harm. She rushed down the steps, now widely awake, smelling dad's coffee and mommy's pancakes. She was safe and secure with no danger at all But not quite as safe as you think At the base of the stairs sat the bear in a chair And he quietly gave her